right, we're going to hit the payroll van. It leaves the edge of Chinatown every day. Bullets won't even dent the van's armor, so get a car and ram it off the road. Now hit it hard, and the punk-ass security guards can bail. And take it to the warehouse at the docks, and my guys are going to take over from there. Now I won't be doing its rounds all day, so don't hang around. What is going on guys and welcome back to the Grand Theft Auto Definitive Edition GTA 3 Part 2 So As you uh, could tell from the cutscene there We're going to have to try and ram A security van Off the road um, I think this mission might be okay uh, We might need a, a few A few cars just to sort it out Because it, it is an armored van after all Make sure I have everything sitting here. Let me, my mood is a wee bit down today. I don't know. I have. I think it's uh, just a bit of. I've just not got enough energy. But uh, sure, we'll try and relax and just enjoy today's episode. Oh, there he is. Let's go up here and just uh, ram off the road. I did uh, adjust the volume of the game a wee bit. I felt as though it was a bit too. Um, too low for my liking. For saying that, I've probably, <laughs> I've probably put it too loud now. Okay, so every time we, uh, the more we damage this van, uh, the more stars that we'll get. So I believe there's a maximum of three stars that we get on this, uh, on this mission. So this van's gonna be pretty fucked by the time I get it, and I have to drive it to a pen spray, and then I have to take it down to. Are we units across from, I think it's the hospital, I believe? I'm not too sure, but I do appreciate everyone who tuned in to the first episode of the series. If you did take the time out of your day to watch the video, I greatly appreciate it. Lots more coming. A video, well, this is being recorded the same day as um, we upload it. And then tomorrow, which is Thursday, episode 3 will be up. Friday, we've got episode 4 coming up. And then we're going to take a break on Saturday because I have things to do. And we'll be putting up episode 5 on the Sunday. So, lots of videos, lots of content. I want to try and get Grand Theft Auto 3 finished in a reasonable time. I said about 10, 10 11 episodes. So, hopefully, it doesn't take too long. Depends. Like, it, it really does depend. It really does depend if. Um, if I can uh, do the missions first time instead of uh, fucking up all the time. Like I did say in, in the last episode that there is going to be a lot of fails. We haven't even scratched the surface of the game yet. There's a lot of retarded missions coming up. Especially in uh, Staten Island. Which is the... Um, which is Manhattan in real life. So I believe this is Brooklyn. So Portland is Brooklyn. Uh, Staten Island is, as I said, Manhattan, and Shoreside Vale, I think, is Staten Island. I don't know. I don't know. But this ain't uh, this ain't too bad, actually, because we're pretty close to the pants, right? If we can get him, pretty fucked here. Okay, w one more hitch, one more hitch should do it. One more big hit. Oh, maybe another hit. This car should do. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Cops. Fuck off. All right, this should be it now. Oh, no. Okay, I need to get I need to get the cops off my ass. Because they're going to end up busting me. And we can't afford to uh, get busted. Ah, fuck you, dude. Alright, she gives enough time to get in the van and get out of there. Ooh, lag. Alright, so. Oh, I have to take the van to the lockup straight away? Oh no. I don't think the van has much health. And we have, uh, well, we have two stars now. Not too bad. Uh, well, actually, no, you know what? I think we can take it into the pants, bro. I think this is gonna be uh, spread. Yeah, I can. Nice! Nice! 
Good start to the episode. Oh, look, she dropped money. Thank you. Much obliged. Oh, for fuck's sake. I literally just hit that cop. Alright, so, I know exactly where we're going. Yeah, I'll never get lost. I'll never get lost in this game because the amount of uh, hours that I have in this game during my childhood, I know every single part of this map. So I'll never, never um, get lost in this game. Like, I'm, I'm trying to think on the PS2 version. Did they have Louis Louis map in the bottom left corner? I do know they didn't have this menu they didn't have the the map like they did in vice city when you open the when you press start so that's a new implementation uh they did add an implement a uh, game mechanic from gta 5 which is the weapon reel uh you'll never see me uh use that uh we're sticking to the og using lb and rb to um cycle through our weapons all right, happy days. Good start to the episode. Twenty grand we got for uh, stealing the the heist. Bam! <laughs> what? You guys, you guys, don't take any notice of me. Uh, El Berlo wants to offer you a job. No, <laughs> an opportunity. All right. Uh, get to the payphone in Hepburn Heights. All righty. So let's, we've got some uh, missions for El Berlo. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna mess up a lot today. I have no energy whatsoever. Uh, we'll try and get through this episode. I don't know how long this episode's gonna be. We'll probably throw in maybe five or six missions. And then move on to the next episode. I'm gonna give myself a good bit of rest tonight. I'm gonna go to bed early. I wanna come back from work tomorrow. We're gonna get stuck in to a longer episode. Hopefully about 40, 45 minutes. Could get just over 10 missions done. So, uh, without further ado, let's get into the next mission with Joey. Hey, man, Tony, I seen the real truth. He purged, you know what I mean? Oh, here's the guy I was telling you about. I right, listen, this guy, he ain't Italian, and he's no mechanic, but he could get things fixed. This is Pops Capo, Tony Cipriani. Hey, I'm Tony Cipriani. Take him to Mama's restaurant in St. Mark's, all right? Now, listen to me. I'm planning a job that needs a good driver, so drop by sometime later, okay? Drive me to the laundry in Chinatown first. I got a bit of business to take care of. I'm both washing women ain't been paying the protection money. And watch the car. Joey just fixed this junk for you. So no fancy crap, okay? All right. So we've been introduced to so Tony. Sony? <laughs> Sony Tip Tipperani. There we go. Um, so if you are familiar with the, the GTA universe, GTA Liberty City Stories, you do play as Tony Cipriani. Uh, it's actually uh, set before this game. So this game actually takes place in 2001. Uh, GTA Liberty City Stories was set in the 80, no, 70s, I think. Uh, a younger Cipriani. But uh, he's an interesting character, that's for sure. I, I, lo I love those Mafia cars, man. The Sentinels are brilliant. Love it. Call my favorite car in this game. What's your favorite uh, car in this game? If you if you made it this far in the video, comment down below on what your favorite car is in GTA 3. <laughs> I always find that hilarious when they shot like when they shot him on his way out of the the laundrette. His body just goes. <laughs> But uh, nah, the game the game still isn't like it can be smooth and then literally just out of nowhere it will um it'll lag. Like look at this, you, you probably might not notice it on the video, but I can notice it on my screen, and it is not aesthetically pleasing. But uh, we're taking uh, Tony to his house. Tony's missions are pretty are pretty good actually. Lol. 
three thousand. Um, audio wise, I'm looking at the audio right now. I don't know <laughs> if it's any better than the first episode. All right, the Uzi is now in stock. All right, I'll meet you in the, the next cutscene. I'm gonna go and get some uh, bullets for the Uzi, and I uh, will finish off Joey's missions, and then we'll head on to do uh, Tony Cipriani's. Beautiful, just beautiful. All right, just the guy I need to talk to. All right, there's a car stuffed with a stiff at the cafe near Callahan Point. One of the Ferrellis thought he was a wise guy, so he got what he had coming to him. Take the corpse to the crusher in Harwood, all right? <laughs> I, I, I literally cannot, can't remember what this mission was. I, I can a wee bit. Uh, but I did lay. <laughs> I did say in the last episode that I would fix the brightness. I have not. I have not. I have no energy. I have literally no energy. So this will be a short episode. Get about five. Uh, well, see, I don't like to do that there, but there's like an extra long one tomorrow. Don't you worry about that. All right, so we take the car. That's right. Oh, I hate the chases in this game. Whoa, man! Get out! Get out of there! I'm gonna take a wee shortcut. Get out of the way, man! <laughs> right. Let's try that again. Holy fucking shit. Absolutely totaled that car. That, that was just my idiotic driving. That was just stupid. I'm just glad there's checkpoints in the game now. Fucking hell. See, back in the day, you had to go all the way back and watch through the cutscene and... Oh, nightmare. Oh, that guy's back. Oh, I need to be careful. You fucking serious? Right. Oh my god. Seriously, like... Just let me get to my fucking location. Oh. Oh my. Oh, brother. See if, <laughs> see if I fucking die again. Through absolute retarded bullshit. Ryan's not going to be happy. Mother of God. Man, they can drive. Oh my God. <laughs> I just noticed there's a body in the back of the car, dude. Oh, see the chases in this game? They are an absolute nightmare. Because if they, like, literally one tap, and your your car is going to fucking uh, flip over. But, um, it was worse in the, er in, like, the, the original versions. I, be I believe that, that it was uh, a lot harder. Like, they could literally blow on you. And, uh, your car would just literally go into oblivion. But here we go, here we go. We're so close. Oh, <gasps> bro, seriously though, if I have all oh, that had a tip. Get, get what? Wait, why? Wait, what? Oh, he's a Ferrelli, okay. I For some reason, I thought it was Mafia. Oh, fuck. Get up there, the fuck. Hello! Yeah, 10,000. Now get the fuck. Fuck you, Ferrelli. Send my regards to Sonny. Right. Anyway. We made uh, more work than we should have there. Suppose it was pretty funny. For you. But anyway, let's get into the next uh, mission. I was going to say episode again there. Back to Joey we go. Let's go. Fucking die, we fuck. Like it. Stop my cock. Have a seat, kid. Take a goddamn seat. 
So the laundry won't pay any protection, huh? The triads think they can mess with me. Let's teach these would-be tough guys what it means to be a tough guy. Sorry, Ma. Yes, Ma. I want you to destroy their laundry vans and mangle any triad gimp that gets in your way. Eight Ball can supply you with what you're going to need. Right. So, we have to do Tony's mission because uh, I cannot be bothered waiting for um, for Joey. Yeah, it says come back between like a certain time, so no thanks. This game is so glitchy, man. Right, so we have to blow up laundry vans. I don't think this is going to be too hard. Uh, but I do believe that they, they do fight back or a convoy will come. But uh, we'll see. Oh, you can. Oh, let's change that now. Nah, eyes. So, in uh, the original version, you had to look right using um, like R R two or L two or whatever, and then shoot. Like you, you couldn't do it, I guess here in the old games, which was uh, pretty shitty. But uh, we'll try and make light work of this mission. Uh. <laughs> what? What is going on? Bro! Whoops. I've been drinking again. Dude, what the hell are you doing, you punk? Jesus, you gimp. <laughs> Like, okay, on a serious note, why can nothing ever be simple when I'm playing games? Like, seriously, like, if, if, if I'm playing this offline, there is no way in hell that this shit happens. I, I don't know what it is, I just think, uh, the world of content creating just wants to see me fail. Uh, I could be, that's, uh, that's good on, uh, on the entertainment side, but when you're sitting in this seat, uh, investing time into this it is uh it's not nice redoing a mission three or four times it's really not all right well that's him gone right we got one more to do but i didn't even like see see okay look at this is what i mean the game uh has been lazy uh, from uh, Groove, I think they call it Grove Street uh, Studios, who took the game's remaster um, and did it up. Like, I didn't even know that their laundry van was uh, on fire until the last second. Like, they fucked up so much in this game. Like, for a PS2 version, or a PS2 era game, you should not be getting lag. You know what I mean? You should not be getting lag. I can understand lag, the odd lag in like the uh, the modern games, but not for a fucking 20 year old game. 21 years actually. 21 years actually. Did I say 21? Uh, okay, there we go. Happy days. That should be that mission completed. Good job, good job. I do like the exp the uh, explosion effects in this game now, which is pretty it's pretty nice. Like, but uh, let's get back into the missions and uh, let's head back on over to Joey. All right, so we're outside Tony's again. Uh, well, Joey must be getting his fucking dick sucked by fucking Misty. Uh, so he's unavailable at the moment. So we'll head back into Tony's mission here. Let's go. The laundry has agreed to pay. You did real good, kid. Go collect the cash and bring it back here. Watch out for the triads. They may be shoving a firecracker up your ass, but don't take no crap. Nobody, I mean nobody, messes with Tony Cipriani. Nobody messes with Tony Cipriani. Okay. Not even, not, not even the Kippers. 
But uh, do you not think uh, Tony sounds like uh, Michael Madsen? Something's telling me that uh, the voice actor is uh, Michael Madsen. I'm not sure. I'm gonna have to look that look that up. It was something that I was meant to look up after the first episode, but I can't remember what it was. I was meant to update you. Bloody hell! Bloody hell! I'm I'm an idiot. But uh, let's head on over here. We have a hundred health, so that's good. Have we have we died yet? I can't recall if we've died. Ah, oh, this mission. Fuck. Uh, this can uh, this can get pretty annoying. This mission. They're all they're gonna surround me, all sides. What did I tell you? The bloody triads. This is where the triad war is not gonna start coming in because we're starting to get into that line of work with the mafia. We're starting to get in after. Uh, That beef. Yeah. Good fucks. Somebody call a medic. Somebody call a medic. Oh, no. I thought he was going to go for me there. Oh, my God. Shitty gun. He said he's going to drill my ass. Oh, my God. Fucking run, you fat cunt! Oh my god! Ah! Oh my god! I can't get in the car! Oh my god, dude! Hey, stop! Oh my god! Why is he not running? Oh, I can't get away from these motherfuckers, though. Oh my god! Don't ah! move! Oh my god! Like, it gets so tired easily. Oh my god! I, like, once I get in, get into a car, he's just gonna fuck. You know what? my oh my god i'm five health get me out lose i'm sorry cop i'm sorry officer but i had to do it i had to do it get out of the way you little cunt i'm gonna die i am gonna fucking die this car is ass oh my days sir Rockstar, I don't have the energy to deal with your shit. I really don't. But we're close to the end here. Are we going back to the house? Alright, oh, okay. Happy days. <laughs> I, I, I made more work than I should have there. For fuck's sake. Woo! 10,000. Not bad, not bad. Easy money is a set. What the fuck? Did he just run up there and just run back down again? What the hell? All right, let's get into the next episode. What? The next mission? Fucking hell. <laughs> of uh, Tony Cipriani, or Kipriani, or whatever you want to call him. Let's go. Don Salvatore has called a meeting. I need you to collect the limo and his boy Joey from the garage. Then get Luigi from his club. Come back here and pick me up. Then we'll all drive over to the boss's place together. Those triads, they don't know when to stop. They want a war, they got a war. Now get going. Oh ho ho! We've been introduced to the Mafia. We're gonna get introduced to the Dawn, even. Dawn Salvatore. And, uh... Oh, that didn't work out too well, did it? Fucking hell. Ah, oh, the game is so laggy. Oh, look at that! You know what I've actually noticed? The more traffic and the more like pedestrians there is in one area, the game's lagging like so bad. Like, look at that. It's ridiculous. I don't really, I, like, I used to love Rockstar, but uh, I can categorically um, say that, uh, what do you call it? I fucking hate them now. I hate them with a passion. I will probably never ever buy another game off them. Wait, I lie. <laughs> I lie, actually, because I uh, GTA 6. Well, whenever that comes out, but um, I've, lo I've, lo I've lost all faith in them, you know. But uh, let's get into it. So we're going to be followed by triads here, I believe. So we need to get take Joey up to the mansion. 
Well, uh, so, so, sort of a mansion, anyway. Best looking house ever, dude. Up. Uh, uh, I don't know if you're using healing music. I have the music turned down really low because I don't want to uh, to get a copyright notice. I think it's at the right, the right level right now. But um, we'll see. We'll see if any uh, claims come up once I edit the video later on tonight. So my plan, my, my plan is every day coming home from work. I think I, I did state this in the first episode. Um, that I'll be coming home and I'll be recording an episode. And then later on, when I put the kids to bed after seven o'clock, I'll be editing the video and then I'll be putting it up live on the channel. It's the best way. But today I've just got no energy. I don't know what it is. So I do, I do apologize if I do seem a bit uh, a bit down. I've just I've just got no energy. Um, but it is what it is. We're still we're still out here grinding. But let's get into it. Beat the horn. All right, here's Luigi. I'm not doing too bad, Luigi. How you doing, good sir? Sorry. Right. High definition booby person. And who else are we picking up? Oh. But uh, <laughs> I need to find out the uh, the cheat for changing your appearance. You can actually turn into one of the pedestrians in this game. Uh, the more you keep uh, putting the cheat code in, it randomizes who you uh, who you are. I think at some point in the playthrough, like one one or two episodes, we will uh, ch change it to a different person. Maybe a mafia guy or some shit. Maybe, I don't know. If you'd like to see that there, do comment down below. Alright, here's Tony Kipperani. Uh, he's like, I am in a bit of a rush here, bro. <laughs> the way he runs. No fancy crap. Oh my god. Well, that was an ambush and a half, holy fuck. There is sometimes in this game where you cannot get out of that situation. Oh, This fucking limo is so slow. Suck my fucking mafia ass. You triad prick. Now I have to get... Now I have to get rid of the cops. Oh my days. <laughs> <laughs> I do not do things. I do not do things simple in this game, or in, or in general, by. All right, there we go. <laughs> I'm not even gonna mention that. You, you you seen it for yourself. For fuck's sake, people falling off the cliff. God damn idiot! Well, I could have just drove in there, but there was no there was no marker. There we go. Nice. Let's introduce you to the Don. Hey, Luigi! Oh, my girls have been missing you so long, Salvatore. You've been away too you long. You tell them once this unfortunate business is taken care of, we'll all go down to the club and celebrate, okay? Here's my boy. How you doing, Pop? You got yourself a good woman yet? Hey, your mother, God bless her soul, would be turning over in her grave to see you without a wife. I know, Pop. I'm working on it. Tony! How's your mama? She's a great woman, you know, strong. She had envy. Too good. Fine. Terrific, terrific. Now, listen, you guys, you go inside while I talk to our new friend here. I see nothing but good things for you, my boy. Iconic. I see nothing but good things for you, my boy. Very iconic. If you see a lot, you see a lot of tributes in this about uh, GTA 3, and that's one of the things... It comes up a lot of people have made videos about it and it's fucking pretty cool like what the the, the community has uh, has done um how long is this you know what ah uh, yeah that's gonna do it that's gonna do it for today i can't go any any, any longer i'm getting fucking I'm, I'm falling asleep uh this will be the shortest 
episode in the series. But uh, tomorrow's episode, episode three, will be at least. Wait there, how do you turn it off? <laughs> we are off. All right. Uh, tomorrow's episode is going to be at least forty minutes, which I, I will be getting at least ten missions done. Well, it really just depends on if I uh, feel like I did today. That's two field, two fields in a row. But that was not my fault. That was just bullshit GTA. But if you did enjoy the episode, guys, I mean, I just have made it to the end of uh of the video make sure you hit that thumbs up if you did like and uh also subscribe if you want to hang around for more content on the channel and uh without further ado have yourselves a great day rest because that's what i'm going to do tonight and uh, i'll see you in tomorrow's episode hope you enjoy guys take it easy